Hello, welcome to the Chris Davis Show. I'm your host, Chris Davis, and today we're going to talk about the C922 Pro WebStream camera. Now, here it is, right here. All right, the C922 Pro Stream Web Camera. The, the design is very aesthetically pleasing. It comes with the, its very own tripod. All right, this is compatible with Windows and with Mac. Okay. What we're going to talk about this camera in particular is how to set it up on the um, on the MacBook Pro. Um, is the reason why we're talking about this is because when I was trying to set it up today, um, I was having difficulty switching from the internal camera, which is what I'm using right now to show you um, the web camera, to to this. Okay, I was having trouble doing that today. Okay, and. So what we're going to talk about is like how to um, switch off your internal your internal webcam and to use this one, okay? All right. So when I was trying to like solve this problem, I went to YouTube, I went to Google, but no one was answering my questions. People were talking about use FaceTime, use Skype, and there you can switch the cameras. But I'm not trying to just use this camera right here for video chatting or do video calls. Excuse me, sorry. Okay. Yeah. I'm not trying to like use this just to do video calls or video chatting. I right? that's not like what like a lot of people are using these cameras for um, they can be used for that but what a lot of people are using these camera for these cameras for these days is to broadcast themselves on YouTube Vimeo Twitch um, game streaming um, that's what they're usually using them for these days um, so it's not just so you can video chat or video call like your family or your friends uh, no, they're using these cameras because um, they have um, great picture quality and they're using them to, like, to broadcast themselves on the platforms I just mentioned. Now, people also mentioned something about web camera settings app for you to download. And you don't have to do any of that. Um, or if you have a MacBook Pro, you don't have to touch FaceTime. You don't have to touch Skype unless you want to use this for video chatting can if you want to but if you just want to use it just to for broadcasting for simple broadcasting all you really have to do um, is um, go to your QuickTime player file new movie recording all right and before you press the record button next to it should be a downward triangle all right so you want to click on that downward triangle and when you click on that downward triangle it shows you options for the microphones you can use and for uh, the different types of cameras you use. So if you see your camera on there that's plugged in to the USB, um, go ahead and select that camera and then it'll switch to that camera. Okay, so that's all we have for today. Um, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. I had to, I finally figured this out by looking at some forums. So I had to make this video to help people. All right, so that's all we have for today. All of you have a great day.